All right, more in-depth coverage now of campaign 2016 at 5 o'clock. We told you how communities across Rhode Island voted. And now we're taking a closer look at the voter turnout. Some had expected near record numbers. And Eyewitness News reporter Julianne Pixoto joins us live with more. Good morning. Well, a dreary Tuesday didn't keep Rhode Islanders from hitting the polls. Now, initially, Board of Elections representatives had anticipated near record breaking voter turnout, but at the end of the day, the numbers weren't quite there. Now, according to the Secretary of State's website, there are about 750,000 registered voters across Rhode Island. 179,000 people cast ballots yesterday, bringing the voter turnout to about 24 percent. Now, that's significantly under the record set in 2008 when 32.5 percent of registered voters hit the polls. Now the turnout yesterday varied significantly based on party affiliation. Compared to the record year in 2008, GOP turnout was up 118 percent yesterday. Democrats can't say the same though. Their turnout was down 36 percent compared to 2008. It could very well be contested, but um, he's, he's obviously going to get the majority vote. It's mathematically impossible for Kasich, like way beyond mathematically impossible. And mo more recently, it's mathematically impossible for uh, Cruz to get the, you know, the 1237. The Coming up in the next half hour, we'll explore just how close the two frontrunners are to clinching their party's nominations. We'll also look at how Rhode Island was divided in the polls. Live in the control room, Julianne Pixoto, Eyewitness News.